dogs are extremely intelligent pets and use a variety of methods to communicate with humans. Licking one's master is one of those communication methods, but is it safe? Is this pig, wet tongue that runs around your face healthy? In this article we will answer these questions and more. Licking is a way for a dog to show his love and affection for his master, this practice allows his brain to release the hormone of happiness, something that calms and reassures. In some cases, he can lick to cheer up his master. It has often been said that a dog's mouth is cleaner than that of a human, but dog expert Marty Becker comes to the contrary. He says it's enough to watch his dog and see where he puts his nose and mouth to realize that the dog's mouth can be a nest of bacteria. Indeed, dogs lick their own genitals, sniff the waste of other animals and suck their vapors. As a result, they can carry bacteria or parasites that can, through contact, trigger periodic epidemics in humans. Examples of diseases transmitted by dogs Ringworm infection Ringworm is a common fungal infection of the skin that is easily transmitted by a dog via contact. This disease causes a scaly rash that can appear as round, red spots on the skin. Other symptoms may appear such as hair loss or flaking on the scalp, itching and blister-like lesions. Methicillin-resistant Staphylococcus aureus MRSA It is a bacterial infection that causes mild skin infections, such as boils or pimples or serious infections such as pneumonia or bacteremia. This disease is spread through skin-to-skin -skin contact, dogs can carry this bacteria with very little impact on their own health. Another type of this infection can manifest itself as in the photo through the appearance of a boil or abscess filled with pus. The area is usually tender or painful and can be red and swollen. Staphylococcal infections are treated with topical antibiotics, oral or intravenous, depending on the type of infection. Some tips to follow for better hygiene with your pet. 1. Avoid that your pet shares your room or that of your children. 2. Regularly clean areas where the animal has access. 3. Avoid having your dog lick your face. 4. Wash your hands with soap and water after touching an animal. 5. Do not neglect collecting your dog's droppings on the street. This prevents the spread of germs. 6. Wash and brush your dog regularly. Be sure to follow the vaccination schedule and take your pet to the veterinarian regularly.